What's that down there? Evening start, Maria Narcisa. Come in. Evening start, Maria Narcisa. Come in. Maria Narcisa here. Cargo received, Maria Narcisa. It all checks out. Affirmative, Maria. Maria Narcisa out. Maria Narcissa. You're not trying to set me up on another blind date, I hope. The Maria Narcissa is a boat. So was the last girl you set me up with. Fisher. Get so me up! Maria Narcissa is a cargo ship owned and operated by Celestinia Inc., a Portuguese shipping company. Registered in the Philippines, cross-Pacific freight contracts. Lots of details missing. Sounds suspicious. Sounds like I'm setting you up for another date after all. Can't wait to meet you. Sir, your primary objectives are complete. Extract you whenever you're ready. You'll need to signal for a helicopter pickup at the top of the lighthouse. Make sure the light is out first. Will do. The body of kidnapped American computer engineer Bruce Morgenholt was discovered in a village in Peru this morning. Implicated in the kidnapping and failed ransom attempt is Hugo Lacerda, alleged leader of the People's Voice, a newly formed guerrilla organization. Here we see the USS Clarence E. Walsh en route to the Yellow Sea for her first assignment amid rising tensions in the region. Dubbed the flagship of a 21st century fleet by Defense Secretary Mason, who reaffirmed America's commitment to our Japanese allies. It is our hope that the presence of the Walsh, now the world's premier electronic and information warfare platform, will help defuse the tensions in the region. Information you recovered in Peru makes it look like Hugo Lacerda was contracted by a third party to kidnap and interrogate Morgan Holt. His payment was in weapons. He appears to be using those arms to equip his own men and pay off debts to other guerrilla groups. 
Maybe Lacerda is a nickel anti loser, but maybe he's learned some things from Morgan Holt that we don't want anyone to know. Maria Narcissa is out to sea, so there's no escape. Board her, search her, find out who Lacerda's been dealing with, and then make sure he doesn't have an opportunity to spread what he knows. Fifth freedom. What Morgan Holt knew about the mass kernels, recursive computation, and weaponized algorithms is akin to what Oppenheimer knew about atoms or what Turing knew about digital computers. Project Watson, the United Nations investigation into the mass kernels, will be remembered for centuries alongside the Manhattan Project as fundamental research that changed the nature of warfare forever. Imagine if Che Guevara had kidnapped and interrogated Oppenheimer in 1959, and you have a pretty accurate parallel of the situation we're in right now. We're going to send the helicopter out about 40 clicks ahead of the Maria Narcissa and leave you in the water on her course. You'll board covertly onto the bow. Search the ship and the holds. Find out what you can about the arms shipments and who Lacerda is dealing with. Satellite imaging shows the Maria Narcissa racks a small launch on the stern. That will be your primary extraction. If things go badly, we might be able to arrange to pluck you out of the sea. We'll keep the Walsh inside a helicopter range of the target vessel at all times. If something goes wrong, we should be able to assist in extraction. If you play it safe, We'll recover you when the ship's launched from open water once you're out of... Fisher, we just pulled up Celestinia's last dry dock report for the Maria Narcissa. They have a newly installed central alarm system. Don't tell me. Three alarms and the mission is over? Of course not. This is no video game, Fisher. You don't want the whole place alerted to your presence. Keep it under control.
out here! Stop hiding! Did I hear some? What was... Fisher, it looks like Lacerda is spreading around his newfound wealth, paying off debts with some of the arms that were delivered to him. You want me to scan any more weapons crates? Better idea. Plant tracking devices on them, and we could see who they end up getting delivered to. Okay. Good job, Sam. That's the first crate. Keep your eyes peeled for any more. All right. Fisher, we just intercepted a radio call from the Maria Narcissa. She's reporting a hull leak and asking for an escort. The ship is sinking. No, but apparently several compartments are flooded. You'll need to activate the bilge in the forward machine room to access... all the cargo holds. Fisher, those compartments are flooded. You need to activate the emergency bilge pump to drain them. Easy down here. Oh my! Makes it easy to sneak up on people. What is this hole? The auxiliary pump is here. There are some flooded compartments. The pump should be able to drain them. Thanks for the information. Ah! There should be a large pump in here that you can use to drain the forward cargo hold. I'll find it. Do 
wanna start that pump there or what? I don't know how this stupid thing works. Captain Diego says hurry up or we'll sink. Well, if I do it wrong, we might sink faster. Then don't do it wrong. Easy for you to say. What's that down there? There should be a large pump in here that you can use to drain the forward cargo hold. I'll find it. Gonna start that pump there or what? I don't know how this stupid thing works. Captain Diego says hurry up or we'll sink. Well, if I do it wrong, we might sink faster. Then don't do it wrong. Easy for you to say. That'll drain the flooding compartments. Now you can search for the bill of lading attached to Lacerda's shipments. All right.
I'm betting that Lacerda's shipping container is somewhere in this compartment. The bill of lading should be mounted on the side. I'll have a look around. These arms to Lacerda was operating through a proxy. Who? Mercantile Costa Fuerta Seguridad de Panama. Offshore bankers? Yeah, the cigar chomping kind. Great. I love bureaucrats. You still need to recover the transit ledger so we can figure out who else Lacerda is dealing with. Try the ship's office, they should have that information. I got a bad feeling about this. Take cover! I'm betting that Lacerda's shipping container is somewhere in this compartment. The bill of lading should be mounted on the side. I'll have a look around. Good work, Sam. It looks like whoever delivered these arms to Lacerda was operating through a proxy. Who? <coughs> Mercantile Costa Fuerta Seguridad de Panama. Offshore bankers? Yeah. Cigar chomping kind. Great. I love bureaucrats. You still need to recover the transit ledger so we can figure out who else Lacerda is dealing with. Try the ship's office. They should have that information. There he is! Fire! <laughs> I love bureaucrats. You still need to recover the transit ledger so we can figure out who else Lacerda is dealing with. Try the ship's office. They should have that information. <laughs> this lady is 
in your suit are detecting a lot of fumes down there. Yeah, I can smell it. It's some kind of gas thing. It could be enough to be a serious explosive hazard. We can't have any firing in the engine room. Wonderful. And don't expect the enemy to be smart enough to realize that. They might still open fire on you if they see you. I get the message. I'll be discreet. enough to be a serious explosive hazard. We can't have any 